So we're back in our winter testing again. Um, really excited to get um, the Prime 941 um, that we're towing behind us out on the water today. We're also going to launch the 683 um, over the Christmas break. Uh, Ross. Uh, participated in a, in a rally in Exmouth and, and came first which was superb and that followed a new kind of setup to the boat where we increased the propeller size and uh, changed the engine height and we were actually running at a really really comfortable 59 knots so incredibly fast but incredibly capable as well um, so we're going back out today just as we've made some more changes just to optimize that see how it runs so just putting the 683 in the water, this is one of our demo fleet. Um, this one's got the 225 Yamaha on it, so it goes so well. Um, yeah, so Fleur's just gonna uh, launch Danny now, and then we'll bring the 941 down. So we've got out here in the 941 and the 683. Um, it's a little bit choppy than we thought, but we're still going to go for the top speed tests. Um, so what we're going to do before that is just a quick walkthrough of both boats. So one of the key things we always say is if you're actually going to invest in a boat, it's very important that you actually go and visit who's building it, get out of the boat and test it in the real environment so you really understand what you're buying. So the purpose of today is just to introduce you to two of our demo fleet. So I'm going to give you a walkthrough of the of our all black 941 and Ross is just going to take you through our 683. All right, hi guys. Um, so we're in our A683 and you might have seen this new model since we first launched it at the tail end of 2019. So it's been really popular. And for this year's demo boat, we really wanted to focus on not only the quality that the ribbons are known for, but we wanted to make this 6.8 like a real driver's boat. Because it's a brand new hull, deep V, high bow. But we wanted to engine it first with this unit on the back here. So this is the one of the first boats we've built, not with a 175 or a 200, but with the V6 Yamaha 225. And just coming out here, it's noticeable that extra grunt you get from the low down, which is good for if you're driving the boat, but also water sports, mono skiing, that sort of thing. But we're gonna test the boat in this as well in a minute, just to show you how fast this boat goes. So we wanted to create the ultimate driver's boat. You know, the 683 and also the 811, which is a larger version of this, they've got all of the standard ribeye A series specification. So flip pieces of upholstery, giving you the safest boarding from the pontoon. Also great for sort of moving around the back of the boat. There's an integrated ladder underneath the step, huge space here where you can actually get a weight board. But the key thing I just want to show you now is the engine, which we'll see, but at the helm as well, we've gone all out on spec. So we've got bucket seats with the bolster. If you look underneath here, we've got those shock suspension units. And what we've found here is we've never created a sit down seat, which is so comfortable when you're driving a boat fast. You see lots of jockey seats, suspension socket jockey seats on all of our boats, but these truly are the bee's knees. So I'm gonna throw the boat around a little bit, show you how fast this boat can, can go. And I, I think the key thing is how comfortable you feel when you're driving it fast. That's why I think this is the ultimate driver's boat. I'm on the 941, um, so we've seen this boat before, but just to run you through it again, this has got the twin 300 setup. Some of the changes we made in December was engine line changes and propeller changes. We've now got this boat, as I said before, running at around 59 knots, but it's not just the bow of the 59 knots, it's how capable it is, how easy it is to drive at that speed. You know, it's a really, really forgiving boat to drive. Um, as with our primes, everything on this boat is absolutely as good as it can be. Um, so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna run the 683, see how it goes with this chopper we've got out here, see what sort of speeds we're getting, see how it feels, and then do that to the more. That engine fills that so perfectly in the back, doesn't it? When, I, when, I, when we launched it earlier, I watched, I watched how it sat in the water with that engine on it, and the proportions were all perfect. I love it. Mate, that looked like so much fun. 
You properly sky over there. I've got up to about 45 knots coming back into the following sea, but the smoke is pretty big out there. So if we head out, we'll try and try and jump and then we'll go from there. Let's do this, come on. Can you hear the coughing here? Yeah. Oh mate, it sounded so good. Yeah. Literally, it sounds great anyway though, because that engine's got that like VC brow to it. So but when you're out, you, when you sky it, it's like raw. It's so good. So Ross, who was just driving the 683, obviously Danny's his twin brother, being in the family business and all that. Danny's now gonna see how close he can get to the 59 knot top speed, even though we're in this swell. Competitive too, so it's yeah, gonna be. Uh, get it done. Be trying I, to beat I actually it. reckon he'll get it done. Whilst there's a bit of swell, you can see he's getting a bit excited over there. Oh, yes, boy! Oh, yeah! I think he's nailed it. That is so cool, isn't it? I honestly don't think I'll find because of the capability of the hull, I, I really don't think you'll find a faster boat than that. Or even in all sea states, you know? Here we go, you're going to get good at it. Which way is he going to go? How did you do? Yeah! <laughs> How did you do? Oh, close, man. Not bad in this swell. No, that's amazing. I'm proud of him. Right, Danny and uh, James heading in now. We're going to wrap up at the castle, but let's follow the all black in so we can see what it looks like underway. way. Oh, here we go. got back in the dark after being out there that was loads of fun we're going to head back up to hq now um, as i said earlier you know if, if you're thinking about buying a boat please come down and see us and experience these these are part of our demo fleet we'll go out on the water and have some fun <laughs> Thank you.